Hi, Happy Gardener friends. My name is Andrea, and we are here today with an update on our Don Juan climbing rose. Take a look. Look, we have flowers. We have a few buds down here. And we have one here in the middle. And look at this, all that red growth is new. And look at, we've got three beautiful buds here. The reason this is so exciting is because uh, last year was our first year to plant it, so it's not even a full year old yet. And I learned last year that climbing roses do not typically put on flowers the first year. They mostly focus all of their energy on growing, producing the canes. So last year we came up here a few times and we talked about the right way to attach the canes to the trellis. And this year we're gonna to get to enjoy some flowers. So our goal this year is to reach the top of the trellis. It's a big trellis. If you'd like to know more about how to make a trellis just like this for less than 30 bucks, I have a video that I'll attach to this. Shows you how to do it, super simple, super easy. Now we'll prune back some of this stuff here so that our rose can focus its energy on growing up the trellis rather than out. The purpose of this rose on this trellis was to give us a little bit of shade and some privacy when this family was sitting on the patio and it's gonna work because it'll fill in a little more. It's only May 1st. We have a lot more time to go this summer. If you are growing a climbing rose at your house, specifically a Don Juan, we'd all like to see it. Join our Facebook group, Favorite Hobby Gardeners, and post pictures of your climbing rose there. Does it smell good? It's not opened up yet, but it does have a fragrance. Don Juans are known to have a lot of fragrance. Well, hopefully, as it opens, it's more scented and we can smell it. It'll be beautiful if we could smell all if of it. If you want to know how to attach your climbing rose to your trellis so that you get the most flowers, then watch the video. I'm going to link to this video so that you can learn how to properly attach your climbing rose to your trellis so that you will get the most flowers possible. Subscribe and follow along because we're going to come back here and watch this climbing rose and hopefully it will grow to the top of the trellis this summer.